Stuart, come on, slow it down, time for sleep. The other night, I had the strange dream. I dreamt I heard a voice calling me. Stuart? Stu? Come on now. Stuart, hurry up. Come on. Stuart, come on now, hurry up. It's Stu, it's mine and station. How did you know all that trains? Oh, well, I've been stalking you. Uh, I mean... Right, Stu, you've got all the gear you need to go train spy. You've got your anorak, your hat, and your notepad. Gil showed me everything. He showed me the best places to stand. He showed me how to write the numbers down from the trains. And he even told me I could touch him somewhere if I wanted to. Wow, that's big. Tell me all over Sarasa and these things. Alright, tell me one place you've been to. Ooh, watch it. Watch what? All good things come to an end. It was time for me to go. Gil came to wank see me off. So when can I become a train driver? Not just yet, young Stu, you're a little bit young. But, oh, I like it a bit young. Bye then, au revoir. See you later, later. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. Oh. I was sad to leave Gil. I was sad that my dream was over. It all seemed so real. As if it had really happened. As if it had really happened. You were. You were. You were. You were. Come on. Wake up. Time to get up. Then I heard my mother calling. And I knew that it had all been just a dream. Only a dream after all. Only a dream after all. Joffrey, Joffrey. Joffrey. Joffrey.